Hey friends, so <laughs> they're already blowing kisses at people. Um, I just got too excited. I mean, I started to see a camera. Here we are. Um, Where are we, Danny? Seattle. Seattle, Washington. And I'm here with Damian. Hola. And you should remember him if you watched my vlogs before because he was in my first ever vlog after I won. The very beginning. After I won Miss Montana. He's the designer at our pageant and he designs all the opening number dresses, which right. is really, really great. So we're very fortunate to have him. We're just like meeting up and getting some food. I don't know where we're going. I've never Actually, never we're been going here. to a place that's called 360, local 360. Um, and the good, play, the good thing about this place is like all the food that it will be there is within 360 miles. So it's oh. it's really fresh and they they support the local I like businesses this. and um, it's I really healthy. Yeah. I love I love 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 supporting local and small businesses because I mean those are the people with the dreams out there and you usually get a great experience or better quality exactly. with a small business because yeah. somebody's heart's going into that and their whole livelihood depends on it. YouTubers are like small businesses, so please subscribe to the channel because this is my business. Anyway, yeah, my business. don't forget to uh, follow me on Instagram yes. as well. It's Damian, like Damian, but I will spell I it out for you. Underscore Emiliano. Emiliano. Isn't that underscore. beautiful? Isn't that a beautiful name? Yeah. Where are you from? You. Tell them. I'm from Argentina. I was born and raised in Argentina, Buenos Aires. <gasps> Guys, we can tango. Look at you. Like stuff. I just got off of a flight, so please. <gasps> well, somebody yeah. said, Danny Walker, I just put my <laughs> shine on it. I was like, what? Let's go. Yeah. Shine I was like, on. <laughs> you look so good. I knew you were showing up like that, and I love well, this Well, I mean, it's just me. Just spray tanned. It looks great, by the way. Thank you. I I, gosh, I, just... I wish that I had the budget to be one of those girls that gets a spray tan every week. It adds up. Like, if you do the spray tan, and your hair, and your nails, Y'all, I'm on a budget. <gasps> it's, it's so beautiful. beautiful. Show oh my to your gosh. Oh yeah, what am I doing? I have <laughs> this. Um, oh, what is this? What is this? We're crossing the bridge from Bellevue to Seattle. <gasps> Hola. Wait, look at like really setting the mood with the candle in the corner. This is so beautiful. Real good stuff. I'm gonna get what am I getting? I'm getting the chicken roulade. Is that how I say it? Roulade. Oh. Yeah. I got to say you look beautiful though. Thank you. You're welcome. This is my natural state of no makeup all the time. Yeah. But you guys have seen that. If you watch the channel, you've seen I am often obsessed. I'm excited for food. Yeah, it's gonna be really good. Healthy. Fresh, local, organic. Yeah. Support small businesses. What am I eating? It looks like ridiculously delicious. I like everything with eggs in it. There's cheesy grits right by the candlelight. How Instagrammable is this? Work it, work it. And we're getting ready for the Beauty Brand Believe Expo and we're going to be modeling some dresses and gowns. Oh, my arm is covering. <laughs> From Bridal Elegance. Look at these pieces. How <laughs> <Nice>. beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Full shoulder, we still see as popular. Oh, ladies, good night. There you go. With us today, um, we are in the birch room. So whenever you have time today, please come visit us. We'd love to see you. And our website is www.bridalelegance.us.com. And of course, as most of you family members know, casual gowns are not on there because of intellectual property. Uh, my husband. Say hi to my team. Hi. Look at we're matching. Look at this coordinating. Here's some vendors with beautiful gowns. And right now I'm headed into the Beauty Brand Believe Expo to just be filled with lots of encouragement from all of our speakers. I love this event because I came last year before I won my title and I felt so capable of accomplishing my dreams after I was just filled with inspiration by the speakers. So ladies, if you ever have the opportunity to attend this event, I would strongly encourage you to do so because there are the best people in pageant and really just in business inspirational figures who attend here and they can give you 
their words of encouragement and advice so you can go out there and conquer whatever it is that you want to and make your dreams possible just like I made mine possible with, with this and now I get the honor of wearing this sash and representing my state. Do you realize you're going on a job interview? Well, what's your job? To lift self-esteem and be good for the organization's branding. Not to promote yourself during your reign. When you won Miss USA, what are the things that you did that you are like, you pretty much can pinpoint, that is how I won. I know one for sure, I think myself. Uh, secondly, I would say in the interview room, I brought a lot of personality. And I think uh, typically, like I come from a government setting, right? So it's easy to probably transfer this very professional voice into every interview room I walk into or a person I speak to. But you have to know that, I'm, I'm sure Lou said this to you as well, they're looking for this contestant, this title holder that's going to talk to little girls, encourage them, get down on her knees, sit on the floor, color with them. So that's how you know you have to bring the personality aspect to it. You're like, it's an interview, but it's a conversation. And I think the third one would be having that clean package to deliver your songs. And when you're on stage, and you must be competing in the USA system or any other system, don't be afraid to bring it. Don't. Like, these, like, I'm sure Luke said, these Spanish girls come out and make it a movement. It's true, though. When you're out there, like, a whole nother side of your brain awakens, and you're like, you know what? These kids gotta move tonight. <laughs> but everybody has their own destiny. Kyra's destiny was to be Miss USA. We all have our own destiny. I did not, I had something happen in my life and all of a sudden I ended. The only thing is you have to be authentic and honest and confident in who you are. It doesn't mean you know 100% who you are, but be open and cut yourself some slack. You know, just be the best you can be and everything will line up for you. And if you don't become Miss USA or you don't win your state title, that's okay because I guarantee you walked out a better person.